What is up, all my fly folks? Welcome to another episode of Shoe Fly TV. As usual, is your boy T, Mr. Shoey P. Newton. Today, we are back with a new episode. I know it has been a minute, but kick back, relax, and welcome to another episode of Shoe Fly TV. What's going on, people? So, um, as you can see, today we got something a little different today. Um, I know it's been a minute, like I said, since I've done any uh, reviews on anything, but this one was a sneaker that I've been looking out for since its inception and pictures first dropped on it. So, this particular sneaker never saw a release date on it. They never said when it was going to be coming out. Um, I actually had... Um, Another one of the one of my friends on Instagram, he actually copped a pair and copped them off of Hibbit. So that's how I knew where to go in order for me to cop a, cop the sneaker. So I um I went on Hibbit. Once I went on Hibbit, they still had almost all the sizes available. So of course, you know what I'm saying, I clicked on. But also too, during that period of time, they had a, a sale, so it was like 20% off. So the sneaker was originally, I believe, 170, and I ended up getting it for like 130 because of the sale. So super clutch, shout out to Hibbit. Um, today we're gonna be doing a review on the Air Max Griffey one, the San Francisco Giants colorway. So like I said, off bat, as soon as I saw this sneaker, this is when I was like, I have to have this pair. Like I live in the Bay Area. I'm about 45 minutes away from San Francisco. Um, UCSF, the hospital out there saved my daughter's life. Shout out to them. So, you know, San Francisco is very near and dear to me. I will not lie. I am not a 100% Giants fan as I was born in Cleveland, Ohio. So I root for the Indians. But when um, San Francisco was winning the championships because I lived out here, I was rooting for them. So I've had San Francisco jerseys. I've had San Francisco gear. So something like this, this was a must cop for me because of living in the area. Um, as far as the um, box that you're going to get with it, the box is just going to be a standard, regular orange Nike box. Nothing special like the plain, plain Nike box. Um, says Nike Air Max Griffey one that has the QR scan code. Um, and as far as getting into the sneaker, I, this is a gorgeous sneaker to be honest with you. So as far as sizing on this, I just want to let everybody know this portion first and foremost Whatever size that you wear, I personally would probably go a half size up because when I got my pair, the size nine, it's a little tight. It's not like unbearable or anything to where I can't wear the sneaker. But if I had known that it was going to be this tight, I probably would have went a half size up because the previous Griffies that I bought, which were the um, Cincinnati red colorway, those are a little bit more loose than these ones are. But um, if you like your shoes a little bit snug, go true to size. But if not, if you want a little bit more room, go a half size up on this sneaker but um as far as the um build of it construction it's done very well um getting into the sneaker you've got the um upper which is comprised of a whole bunch of different colors you got your black suede and then um you've got your um swoosh which is done in black with an orange outline and then you've got the orange um eyelets of course tongue's gonna be black there's a um orange nike sign at the top of the tongue and which your um side lock um, is going to have an orange thing on the um strap and then there's the white 24 with the orange nike and then on the side panel it's actually a coconut is what the box says like a off white um leather as opposed to a white leather but then coming down to the midsole you do get the white as well as the black hints and then coming around to the heel you have the um black nike check with the orange outline and then on the outsole it's going to be like all black and then you're going to have orange accents throughout the um rest of the outsole like i said this sneaker done extremely well um as far as um, glue stains or any imperfections, I really don't see any at all on this sneaker. Um, just a beautiful colorway. I have gotten so many compliments wearing this particular sneaker. Of course, I know because I live in the Bay Area, everybody's going to be probably a little bit extra with it because it is a San Francisco colorway. But all around, the person that actually bought these where I got the idea to buy them from, he lives in Ohio. 
where I come from. So it's just a clean colorway all around. But like I said, as soon as I saw pictures of these, this is a sneaker that I said I had to have this sneaker and I went out and copped it immediately. Um, to be honest with you, a lot of people in my area, I haven't seen them with this particular colorway. So I'm super glad to own it. When I went back on Hibbit, they only had maybe three sizes available left of them. So um, like I said, just super happy to own this sneaker, like I said, been on the lookout for them as soon as I saw pictures of them and glad that I was able to uh, catch the homie and actually get my hands on a, a pair of these bad boys. But beautiful sneaker, if you don't have a pair and you want a pair, check Hibbit. I'm not sure if any other sites are gonna be coming out with these, I know for sure. Hibbit did, but um, maybe some of your local stores will probably also have some too, especially if you have a local Hibbit. I will go run and um, check them out. Yeah, I, like I said, this is just another review. I wanted to give you guys a look at this uh, particular sneaker because, like I said, it's something different. And it's a sneaker, like I said, that I know I don't think a lot of people that I know have. I haven't seen them on the streets a lot. So I just wanted to give you guys my point of view on what they look like. And then, of course, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think of the sneaker. You think these are fresh? Do you think it was a pass? Like, do you want a pair? You're going to go looking for them? Let me know what you guys think. I appreciate the support as always. You guys have always been rocking with your boy and I appreciate it, man. Nothing but love. This has been another episode of Shoe Fly TV. It's your boy, Shoey P. And as always, be blessed, keep it fresh, and stay Shoe Fly. We out.